morning everybody and welcome to Silverwood Theme Park. We are just north of Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. And if you're not familiar with Silverwood Theme Park, they've actually got two parks here. They've got an amusement park with roller coasters and rides, and they also have a water park. Boulder Beach, uh, which is unfortunately closed at the moment, which is fine because the weather's not great today anyway, so we wouldn't be going on any water slides anyhow. So come along as we show you around Silverwood. Stunt Pilot, their brand new roller coaster. Oh, I have tears coming down my face. That thing's insane. It's, it's a new style coaster that has been kind of going around. Uh, you sit um, what? Like, in, you know, in a single, single, yeah, single, single row. row. Kind of like Space Mountain, if you think about Space Mountain at yeah. Disney. Uh, but that, this thing's insane. Um, it's Stunt Pilot, that's kind of gives you an idea what it is with that drop at the very beginning. What did your heart rate get to? <laughs> so I uh, put my Fitbit on to, to a workout to test my heart rate. So my resting's 55. When I got off it, it was 124. <laughs> so it gave you a little idea of uh, what it's like in the front row. <laughs> um, felt a little dizzy when it ended. Oh, totally. It came off and I was I couldn't walk straight. Yeah. <laughs> it was uh, nuts. Fun ride. I don't think I'm going to do it a second time. I think once is yeah, enough I think, for Yeah, me, especially having the front. I'm getting too old for this, I, don't I know. guess. Yeah. It was either front or back. I got front, so I'm good. Anyway, so that's Stunt Pilot. <laughs> cool ride. What you sit in. So it's got this full big restraint that comes down over and locks. Um, but one thing to note, these don't tighten. So as you do a loops, they can stretch. So we're on the most intense <laughs> ride here. We waited 45 minutes to go on the antique cars because we're crazy like that. And actually, we just have all day, so why not have a little bit of fun? Exactly. Kim, how, you're not, you drive about as good as this as you do with the normal truck. <laughs> it's almost like you're drunk or something. Oh gosh, dang, you're gonna kill me. Oh my gosh, you need to learn how to drive. That was Timber Terror. That's this just one, this one we got in the back the back row. So I went front row, then to the back row. Yeah, that thing is that's whipped. a that's a cool classic old roller coaster yeah. with just all those uh, whoop de doos that just take your stomach out. And yeah, if you sit in the back, that thing just whips you around. It felt like we we're gonna fly right off that track, but another really cool ride. They got a couple roller coasters, wooden roller coasters here. That one's a little bit more mellow one. The one we're gonna go on next is a little out of control for a wooden coaster, but uh, still really fun coaster to, uh, to get on for sure. Oh, and uh, one thing to note that for each of these rides, there's only one train going. So if you have backpacks and stuff, you don't have to get a locker. They actually have little locker storage for each ride that goes through. So your stuff, stuff is safe. So you don't have to take it because you can't take it on the coaster with you. But they'll take it and store it for you while you go on the ride. <laughs> So that wooden coaster is absolutely insane. And we got back again. <laughs> and it felt like we were really going to die on that one. Um, so fast. And it popped. It made some weird noise. So that really freaked me out. I kept lifting off my seat multiple times. Yeah. If you have uh, head in, head issues or something. <laughs> or heart issues. Probably not the best ride, but that was a fun one. <laughs> the food. Excellent for a little amusement yeah. park. Eight dollars a piece for cactus something. Yeah, cactus whatever, cactus Jack, cactus Joe, little Mexican place that they've got here. Eight dollars though for burrito, quesadilla, nacho. And That's it, unheard of. And it's a build your own, so you can put on it whatever you did. So yeah. we did the nacho, and we put everything on it. It was absolutely huge. Yeah, you could have fed a family of four. Very uh, affordable, which is uh, pretty yeah. cool with these small theme parks. Uh, they know it's you know families are going to be coming here, and, and you know one of the big things when you go to Disney or some of those places is. You know, buying the food, I mean, it cost you hundreds of dollars, and here fed us uh, two for 24, for 24 bucks, so uh, really good deal. 
And I also want to mention with this Tremors uh, roller coaster that we're checking out right now, this is a crazy roller coaster. It has two drop tunnels that actually go uh, in, underground, and one actually goes through the gift shop. So that's pretty neat. You can actually sit in the gift shop and watch the roller coaster go through, and it actually shakes the whole thing like an earthquake. Hence, Tremors. Tonight it says it's open. Just went by and nobody even had a poncho on. Oh, and it's uh, what do you th how warm you think it is? 60? 60 maybe. It's, there's not even any sun. We've got sweatshirts on, so yeah, the sign says you will get wet. We won't get wet. Some other people are gonna get wet though. Babe, you don't want to do that? Dude, do you feel that wind? Yeah. Hey, babe, look at that. Huckleberry. Okay, what did you get? <laughs> what do you think I got? Huckleberry lemonade. Goodness gracious. She just don't <laughs> stop with the huckleberry. Yeah. Look with at the, the actual, huckleberries in that. the actual huckleberries in it. Man, that, that is, is really so good. good. There's fresh lemon squeeze in the bottom of it and actual huckleberries. It's really good. Yeah. Folks. It says candles on it. Oh. All this stuff, all of these. Dude, what I thought it? that was an apple cobbler. I want to eat it. That's a candle. Oh. How cool is that? Huh. Oh, that's like a s'mores. Look at these things. Cinnamon bun? Oh, I bet that smells good. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, you can't smell in video, but it smells awesome. Silverwood Theme Park is an amusement park located in the city of Athol in northern Idaho, near the town of Coeur d'Alene and approximately 47 miles from Spokane, Washington. Owner Gary Norton opened the park on June 20th, 1988. Originally, the park included a small assortment of carnival rides, a main street with shops and eateries, and an authentic steam train that traveled in a 30 minute loop around the owner's property. Over the years, Silverwood has grown in both size and popularity, transforming from a small local amusement park to a regional theme park destination. In 2003, an adjacent water park named Boulder Beach was opened. Entrance to Boulder Beach is included with admission to Silverwood. In 2009, Silverwood began an annual Halloween event called Scarywood, held during the evenings in the month of October. Today, Silverwood is the largest theme and water park in the American Northwest on 413 acres and boasting more than 70 rides, slides, shows, and attractions. It is the northernmost theme park in the United States. So that concludes our day here at Silverwood. I hope you guys enjoyed our tour. Uh, we had a blast. As always, every time we come here, we just seem to have uh, a lot of fun. It's just such a cool amusement park to come to. It's just, um, it's, it's different. It's relaxing. It's yeah. more, if you don't have all the hustle and bustle. Right, yeah, it's just a really fun place to uh, come to. So highly recommend if you ever get a chance, uh, make a stop at Silverwood if you're ever in this area.